So I want you to start by putting your hands on your shoulders, touch them up there, and we're going to fall by going knees, hip, shoulder. Okay, so let's give it a go, eh? Ready, go. Knees, hips, shoulder. Nice, up again. This time I want you to do it and think about where your head's going. So it tucks in on the opposite shoulder that's hitting the ground so it stays off the ground. So when you go down, I want you to call out loud, knees, hips, shoulder, and tuck that head up. Ready, go. Tuck that head off, yeah, nice, and stand up. And let's see if we can go down the other, on the opposite side, doing the same thing, tucking your head the other way. All right, go. Knees, hip, shoulder. So what we're trying to avoid is your head hitting the ground by tucking it to the opposite shoulder. Keeps your head safe from being in contact with the ground. Okay, stand up. So this time I want you to do the same and as soon as you hit the ground then I just want you to place your hands out like you're placing the ball out, eh? Keeping that head tucked in. What we call it in martial arts, we tuck in like a hedgehog or a turtle. Stay safe and roll over. Keeps you nice and tight, okay? So let's try it again, eh? Cool it out and then place that ball out. All right, go. And place out. Nice. You're running with the ball, you've been tackled. Let's go through that whole thing again. Ready? Go. Drop. And now stop there. What did you do then, young fella? When you fell, you had one ball and put the other hand out to help you fall. That's a no-no, because you could break your arm or dislocate your shoulder by falling down like that. Keep hold of that ball and keep tucked up tight like the hedgehog or the turtle we talked about. Okay, let's try it again, eh? Ready, go. Knees, hips, shoulder, that's better. Nice, 